First of all, I'm sorry about the quality of the video, but I'm recording here very fast from my phone. So if you have a Surface 4 Pro and when you start it, it's kind of stuck into a boot loop and then it goes into Wi-Fi, Wi-Fi menu, then I'm going to show you here how to fix it very, very easy. You see it was in a, is in a boot loop and then it comes into Surface Wi-Fi. From here, you can't really reset it. Um, even if you try to do the hard reset with the buttons, it's, it will still come here. So what you have to do is come into security, change here the secure boot, change it to none. You see now secure boot is disabled. And uh, what you will need is here on the back side, uh, you will need your ID. And with this ID, you take the ID and come into a website here support microsoft.com uh, surface recovery image you select your product surface 4 pro and then you enter your serial number press continue and you're gonna have a button to download recovery image i did download it already let me show you here into my download section download you see here surface and let me close this one surface pro 4 uh, and you ha all you have to do is extract all of these files to a USB flash drive. Uh, I did that already. I extracted, I extracted everything to this USB flash drive. So now all you have to do is let's plug, let's plug in the flash drive and let's go restart now. Now it's gonna, you should see at the top like a red menu. Yeah, you see it's red. This means that your boot is unlocked and you see the flash drive is also flashing. This means that uh, the surface is reading the USB flash drive. Let's see the next steps. Oh, you see already here it's loading, so that's good news. Uh, again, I'm sorry about the quality, but I'm recording from my phone. So let's choose here English, uh, yes, US, and then here you have it. Recover from a drive, advanced options. There are no restore points into the system, so all you can do is reset your um, Surface 4. This, it should work for other surfaces as well. Let's go recover from a drive. And just remove my files. I'm gonna do a full clean, clean of the drive. And from here on, well, it's just uh, normally as when you reinstall a new Windows or yeah, when you reset a PC. So yeah, I hope this video was useful for you guys. So I see you in the next one.